98.1 FM and AM 1220. So much coronavirus info out there. Thank you, KHTS, for keeping it local and easy to understand. Live and local. We are live and local. It is 427 here on KHTS. Joining me on the line right now, special guest, Dr. Megan LeCornu of Embrace Your Smile Orthodontics, voted Santa Cruz's leading orthodontics office for the past 10 years, offices in Newhall and now in Valencia. Dr. Megan, are you on the line? I am. How are you? I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. I'm very, I'm very strict with myself, so it's been very isolating. How have you been these past couple months? You know, it is. it was uh, also we have been very strict with ourselves. We, uh, we were quarantining and um, had the practice closed for about 12 weeks Yikes. and um, we're able to reopen uh, in June, which was great. And, you know, just implementing new procedures and protocols to make sure we do our part in keeping everybody safe. Right. So did you guys get those new federal guidelines from the CDC? Because you guys were kind of PPE hipsters. Like you guys had already been wearing all the protective equipment and taking all the preventative measures before the Rona hit. So what changed from before coronavirus shut everything down to now? Yeah. So, you know, all healthcare offices uh, employ what we call standard or universal precautions. And those precautions were set in place to protect, you know, our patients and our staff and our communities from things like influenza, you know, hepatitis, A, B, C, HIV, um, tuberculosis. So we already employ these types of precautions to make sure we're keeping everyone safe. Um, with coronavirus, we've actually increased the precautions that we take. And we now make sure that we take every parent and patient's um, temperature at the door. We really limit the number of people that come in the office. So we typically prefer if parents don't come in the office with their children, if possible. Now, that being said, if it's a young minor, we have any anxiety issues. We definitely uh, make it work and we put them in some semi-private rooms and are able to keep them apart from from other patients. Um, And then obviously we have screens at our patient checkout area that protect our staff and our patients and everyone up front is wearing masks in the office now where in the past our front staff, our clerical staff and our front staff who did our schedule coordinating didn't need to do that. So, but yeah, you know, I think, I think as everyone in our community, we're all just adapting to kind of the new standards and and the new, what we call the new norm. Yeah, the um, new abnormal. Yes, (laughs) exactly. Yeah, it's crazy. I mean, I'm quite frankly, uh, kind of surprised that you guys are back up and running, have been for months, but it does sound like you guys have it under lockstep. Are there any procedures or any kind of, is there anything off limits? Are you guys allowed to take new patients? Is there anything outside of the bounds? Yeah, so we are taking new patients. Um, Pretty much we are able to resume normal, uh, basically normal services, normal treatment protocols. Um, because we are an orthodontic office, it has made it a little bit easier because we do not use, you know, some of the high speed hand pieces and aerosolize as much as some of um, my colleagues who are general dentists do. So it does make things maybe a little easier for us. That being said, um, you know, even my colleagues who are in general dentistry or endodontics or oral surgery, I think all of us have been able to resume our normal services and provide treatment to patients in the community just by employing, number one, standard precautions, and number two, some of these extra precautions that we're utilizing uh, for COVID-19. She's Dr. Megan LaCornu of Embrace Your Smile Orthodontics, the top orthodontics office in the Santa Cruz Valley for over 10 years now. Um, I did not have braces growing up. We talked about it before. My brother and sister did. And knowing teenagers that have braces and orthodontic issues and everything, I know that they'll take any excuse not to go into the orthodontics office. Have you, <laughs> yeah. had to, have you had to chase down any patients or anything? Are people using it as an excuse not to come in for the regular checkup? Yeah, you know, I think there's a lot of patients that have a little bit more heightened <laughs> fear about going into any healthcare offices, which is completely understandable. So, you know, some of those patients, we either try to um, adjust our treatment regimen on them and basically slow things up, making sure that they're doing a good job of keeping their appliances clean. We also have patients who've been ready to start treatment, 
and they don't want to come into the offices frequently. So sometimes we change what our treatment recommendation is um, to cater to their requests and their needs. And a good example is we have some patients that initially we were planning on starting with braces and we decided to go with Invisalign instead because with Invisalign we can go a little bit longer between visits. Oh, nice. I was reading this, uh, according to the American Dental Association, this is a very positive sign. Uh, to date, as of August 4th, no cases of COVID-19 have been uh, attributed to any dental practices in the United States. So that is good news. And it does sound like you guys yeah. have the, the PPE and safety measures and uh, extra safety measures in place. Again, we're talking to uh, Dr. Megan LaCorne of Embrace Your Smile Orthodontics. You guys have offices in both Newhall and Valencia. Are both offices still open or is it just one? Yeah, so both offices are open. We are um, kind of redu- operating at a slightly reduced capacity, so we're not seeing as many patients as we were seeing in the past, which does make the schedule a little bit more challenging, but we're all working with our patients and our staff and our teams to, to keep things moving. And, you know, regarding um, that report that came from the ADA, I'm, I'm really not surprised to hear that because the truth is, is some of your healthcare facilities are probably some of the cleanest and safest places to be because of our routine sanitizing um, protocols that we already employ. You know, all of the sanitizers we utilize are basically, you know, graded to kill coronavirus, to kill tuberculosis, to kill all of these on contact. And they're very, very strong disinfecting and cleaning agents that we've employed for years and years now. And so I think, um, you know, I think the fact that there's no reported cases from dental offices shouldn't be a surprise to people. I, I do feel like those healthcare facilities are, you know, very, very safe because of the, the protocols we already employ with standard precautions and universal precautions. Dr. Megan LaCorne, you embrace your smile with Adonics joining us on the line. Personally, any new skills? Are you reading anything of no anything like that over the quarantine? (laughs) Now, that's a great question. I've recently picked up paddle boarding. (laughs) Really? I hear that's quite the workout. I can't do it. I don't have the upper body strength. And I thought, I thought no better way to be social distancing than to be out on the water, like, you know, (laughs) far away from anybody. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So that's been my, my new, um, project since all of this has occurred. <laughs> nice. Nice. Well, Dr. Megan, thank you so much for taking some time out of your busy schedule to join us and uh, much health moving forward. And hopefully you guys are back to, hopefully everybody's back to normal. I don't like having you over the phone. I'd prefer you be here in studio. I know. I agree. Well, hopefully, yeah. hopefully I'll get to see you soon and hopefully um, we'll, we'll be back to normal soon. All right, Dr. Megan, take care. All right. You too. Mm, bye. Bye. It is 436. That is Dr. Megan LaCorne of Brace Your Smile Orthodontics. Joining us on the line. Again, you can meet the team. Request a complimentary consultation. Schedule an appointment. Look over all of your treatment options and more at EmbraceYourSmile.com. That is EmbraceYourSmile.com. Embrace Your Smile Orthodontics, the top and leading orthodontist office in Santa Cruz for the past 10 years. Time for a quick break. More music coming up.